Muscles are often stiff and hands often tremble. More than a million people in America suffer from Parkinson's disease. The National Institutes of Health reports the disease affects nerve cells in the brain with Parkinson's. Speech is difficult and so is finding your balance. But NT Daily's Giovanni Pantoja shows us how one North Texas woman is not letting this chronic disease impact her passion. Why do you breathe? I just faint. I have to. Tina Epstein is part of a small percentage of Americans that are diagnosed with Parkinson's before the age of 60. Epstein also suffers from rheumatoid arthritis. In the past four months, Epstein's body has deteriorated in what it takes most patients 10 to 15 years. It's a struggle to get out of bed. I have help to help me shower and dress. Epstein fell into a depression after her body started to fail her. My hands have bad dystonia. They're stiff and I couldn't get a paintbrush in them. And I got hysterical. Lost on what to do, she decided to do what she knows best, and that is to paint. I went up, started using my hands, the word adapt, and I painted a painting, posted it on Facebook, and had eight people contact me to buy. She says that a few people have said it's her best work yet. Thank goodness for Parkinson's. I may never have discovered this had I not had Parkinson's. Epstein says she's finally living her best life. She hopes others with chronic illnesses are inspired by her attitude and her artwork. You watch the reaction of people around her. They are all very proud of her for what she is able to do. Epstein sells her paintings for donations to give back to the Parkinson's community. Giovanni Pantoja, NT Daily News. Donations from Epstein's artwork is poured into Parkinson's Voice Project and Artful Artwork. Artful Artwork.